A military prosecutor says a decorated Navy SEAL bragged about killing a teenage Islamic State prisoner in Iraq. Opening statements began today in the court-martial trial of Special Operations Chief Edward Gallagher, who faces life in prison if convicted. News 8's Kelly Hassadal is live at Naval Base San Diego with more. Kelly? That's right, uh, Marcel and Barbara Lee, both sides to take painting a very different picture of the special operations chief. Prosecutors say he's a murderer who posed up for photos with a dead ISIS uh, fighting teenager and actually celebrated it. However, the defense attorneys say these allegations come from a group of disgruntled subordinates who are lying. Video of Navy SEAL Edward Gallagher and his wife entering Naval Base San Diego on day two of the trial against him. Cameras are not allowed inside the courtroom. During opening statements, prosecutors told the jury of five Marines and two Navy members that Gallagher posed with the body of a teenage ISIS fighter that he stabbed back in May of 2017 and texted the photo to fellow SEALs and even encouraged them to pose behind him with the body. On the witness stand first, Lieutenant Thomas McNeil, who served with Gallagher in 2017. He testified about a photo in which he says Gallagher is holding the detainee's head up by his hair in one hand and his knife in the other. McNeil told the jury about conversations where Gallagher said he wanted the photos deleted. He also says he and Gallagher met in a parking lot at one point, where Gallagher allegedly said, quote, you take me down, I'll take all of you down. I've got expletive on all of you. Lies. Gallagher's defense attorney, Tim Palatori. The, the whole theme of our opening, the theme of our case, you know, that this is not a murder, this is a mutiny. This is a group of young disgruntled sailors that didn't like being told that they were cowards. And so they decided to conspire to take down the chief. He pointed out that Lieutenant McNeil was granted immunity for his testimony. Each one of these witnesses is going to come in and tell their own individual uh, story. And we're going to have to go through each one of them, expose each one of them for lying. And the jury was sent home about 3.15 this afternoon. Uh, they will be back in court at 9 a.m. tomorrow. Now, coming up new at 6.30 tonight, uh, defense attorneys asked Lieutenant McNeil, uh, isn't it true the platoon took many photos of dead bodies and even edited them together with music? We'll talk more about that all new at 6.30. Back to you. All right, Kelly, thank you.